good? Yeah. Well, I have to tell you guys, I have Olympic style sex. Not that it's very enduring or athletic, but it only happens once every four years. <laughs> Upcoming is January. It's going to be the Winter Olympics. <clears throat> oh, shit. It's been a while. Oh, sorry. Um, you know, the last girl that I was in with was a real whore. You know, literally, she was a whore. She wore a gun in Trump. Her name was Michelle. Yeah, at uh, the chicken ranch down there. Um, so uh, this year is was a big year for me. Uh, I uh, all of a sudden I'm blacking out here. Um, it was a big year for me. I went to uh, the Poor House in Prom, Nevada, and I went to Disney World. So you can say I've been to the happiest place on earth. In the land of Florida. Uh, before I was coming up here, um, I was kind of nervous, but there's something that always soothes my nerves, and it's I always think about my first dog I ever had, and my first dog was named after the town drunk, and boy did me and Grandma have fun playing fetch. <laughs> Yeah, um, you guys, uh, you might be wondering what the hell is wrong with me I'm up here. I got this rare disease. It's called cerebral ataxia. In case you guys don't know what that means, that means two things. The first thing is it slows down my speech patterns and makes me talk very slow, and I sound sometimes like a stroke victim. Two is uh, it makes it sound like if I have two beers, it's like 10 beers to a normal human. So I've already had six, so you guys gotta play catch up. Woo! I, uh, I work at Walmart, I've been there eight years. Yes. Hold on, that's not the punchline, sir. Um, oh, originally it was a 15 year sentence, but I got knocked down to nine. So uh, next year on Good Behavior, they're going to transfer me. I can finish my uh, my sentence at Target. Oh, but uh, working at Walmart, you know, it's kind of like being in the mob because the further and further you get in, it's that much harder to get out. So I like to stay on the outer rim, make sure um, I don't cause a big scene because if I do decide to leave, I don't want somebody to put two in the back of my head and whack me. Oh, but um, at at what at Walmart? Sorry, yeah, at Walmart. Um, I was in the break room, and the coworker of mine came in. And she goes, "Travis, there's a girl outside waiting for you." And I said, "Wait, are the cops weather?" It's probably because she didn't like my pickup line. Hey, girl, you want to see my dungeon? So, anyways, uh, whenever. I have this room in the house. Whenever my mom or pa made a fresh plate of food for me or my siblings, and they put it down in front of our face, and we said, "Ew!" that means that we had to automatically eat the food. So one time in the middle of the night, I am walking by my parents' bedroom, and I see them having sex. And I go, "Ew!" And my father, in mid-thrust, stops, looks at me, and says, You know what that means? I said, Nuh-uh, I don't like fish. So I had to pack my stuff and get the hell out of the house. You cannot believe how hard it is to pack when you're five. It's a pain in the ass to pack your Teddy Ruxpin into your Ninja Turtle carrying case. <laughs> <laughs> um... Yeah, I, I recently uh, stopped taking drugs. Been uh, clean and sober for one week. By drugs, I mean masturbation. <laughs> now I didn't want to stop, but my corporal tunnel was acting up. So, uh, before I go, I have to tell you guys something very personal. Oh boy! I shave my balls. Um, yes. <laughs> thank you. Good. <laughs> uh, no, I was in the I was in the shower shaping them, and I'm cutting and shaping them. 
I end up nicking him. And I go, ooh! So I get out of the shower. I'm looking for something, anything to stop bleeding. I couldn't find anything except for a maxi pad. I grabbed that and I slapped that sucker on there. Now it didn't stop bleeding, but I feel fresh like a summer's eve. <laughs> Thank you guys.